Hi everyone, it is Sheila and it is weekly haul time. I am not going to spend a lot of time talking. This is like my third time of trying to do this video and I just keep messing up for some reason today. It's very warm in here. I really should turn on the AC and um, I don't know why I haven't, but I'm going to try to go ahead and get through this video without stopping and turning on the AC. It's gotten really warm today here in San Antonio, which is great. I love the summer. So um, without further ado, I want to share with you very quickly some of the items that I purchased this week. I did not do a lot this week because I did have some computer issues and had to spend quite a bit of money on buying a new hard drive for my laptop. So that cut into my haul money, which meant my haul is a little bit smaller this week. But that's OK, because me having spent the money on my laptop allows me to be able to share this with you today. So without further ado. I did go into Walmart this week and I embraced myself with um, the flower line by Drew Barrymore. I fell in love with the mascara, which is this one right here. It is the ultimate zoom in ultimate mascara. And I'm not going to do any talking about it because I'm going to do a separate video that I'm going to review some of the flower products. But I will say this much. Absolutely freaking love this mascara. It's awesome. And then I did purchase um, four lipsticks. The black one represents a shine. And then the other, the white ones are all matte. So I'm going to kind of put these up to the camera so that you can see what they look like. That's just the colors. There's a nude. There's kind of like a, a corally color. And then there's kind of a um, more of like a ginger color. And then there is a, um, did I say pink? I don't know if I said all the colors. But anyway, really really like this i would suggest if you are a person and you don't have a lot of money to spend you and you're looking for a good lipstick i i will honestly say these are great lipsticks so they are definitely worth the six dollars and 98 cents that i paid for them and then when i went into walgreens this week i ran into um well i was over in the the cosmetic section and i saw some perfumes over there and I saw that they had the Wonderstruck by Taylor Swift in there. Now, I sampled this at Sephora and I've worn the sample a few times and I thought it really smelled good. And um, I was actually going to buy the little rollerball one. And I think the rollerball one is either 20 or 25. I can't remember. I think it's 20. But um, they had this and it's a 1.4 ounce at Walgreens for regular price $32.99. But if you have their, I think it's beauty card, a bonus card or whatever it's called, you got $5 off this week. And plus you got like some beauty points. So I ended up buying this today. I actually bought it today. I um, ended up paying the, the total price was $27.99 for this. So I'm really excited about this. This is going to be kind of like my go-to perfume for the summer, like my everyday um, just wearing perfume because it's a, it's like a soft scent. And I really do like it. And speaking of scents, I was in Dillard's this week because I actually went in there to purchase a um, something from Mac. And um, I the lady approached me to smell their um, the flower bomb perfume, and I fell in love. I mean, I love this perfume. She gave me a cute little sample, which I wore every day this week after I got my sample. Oh my goodness. I love this perfume. This I want for Mother's Day. So I'm hoping that my husband will watch this and um, I'm hoping that they will actually have a gift set come in the store and I can get it for Mother's Day. Even, even if they don't have a gift set, I do want this particular perfume. I am going to ask my husband for this for Mother's Day because I truly, truly love it. It smells so good. And I feel like I deserve it, <laughs> but um, which is why I went into, um, I'm very hot. I went into um, Dillard's in the first place was to get the MAC Prep and Prime Lash Base um, I, um, my Eyelash Primer. And I really love using Eyelash Primer. I don't have the actual item to show you because I think I may have left it on my desk at work. So I apologize for that. But this is the box that it came in. It's just, you know, it's just eyelash primer nothing big and fantastic but i do love it it makes a big difference to me when i put on my um mascara i know a lot of people don't like it <clears throat> excuse me but i do like it and i think it makes a big difference i went into sephora today <coughs> excuse me went into sephora today to purchase hopefully to purchase another one of these sweatshirts that i have on and unfortunately um 
they did not have anymore. And I paid a whopping four dollars for the sweatshirt. So I should not even, you know, I should know that I'm probably never going to find any more because, you know, that price, everybody, probably, everyone brought them. So that's OK. But of course, when I went into Sephora, I did notice that, you know, or I went into JCPenney's. I can't help but notice a big Sephora that's inside of JCPenney's because, you know, that's usually when I'm at home, that's when I always go into. And I thought, oh, I'll just go real quickly and look to see what they have. Do my little beeline, as I like to call it, down one aisle, go around and come back around and then go around and hit the other side of the store and come back where I started from. Well, I did my beeline, but of course I got stopped in between. But one of the things that just totally intrigued me was the this particular item here. I saw this and I thought, wow. And, you know, I haven't really been into blushes very much ever. And then I got my little NARS palette and I really like playing with those blushes for whatever reason. And when I saw this, this had a bright pink in it and it had a mascara, which, you know, I'm always looking for mascara, even though I can love one. I still look for others. It had a lip gloss in it and um, this little compact. So. I was very intrigued by it. It says New Year, New You, and it, the kit contains mascara, Lash Gasm Mascara, Exclusive New Year, New You, Trio Compact, and then Glamour Gloss. So that's what it says is, it contains, which is pretty much right. <laughs> um, this is the, the mascara, which I don't want to open because, of course, I want to save that for you know, when I'm ready to use it. So I'm not going to open it up. And then this is the uh, the blush. This is the lip gloss, which is a beautiful, kind of like a natural color pink, I guess. Not very, um, kind of like lip color pink. And I do really, really like that. I did put a little bit of that on my lips because when I was doing this video a minute ago, I um, decided to put some on because I am wearing that nude color, which I do really, really like. It's just not friendly for a video because you really can't see it. But I did have that on my lips and I just kind of covered it, put over this gloss over it so that I could kind of see what this gloss looks like. I don't really wear a lot of glosses, but I do like them every now and then. And especially in the summertime, if I'm just going to hang out at my husband's uh, softball game or something like that, especially because then I don't have to worry about you know, the heaviness of lipstick and things like that. So I'm really excited about having this. It's a really pretty color. So I think with like a, like kind of maybe a, a mauve pink, uh, mauve pinkish color lip liner, that will probably be real pretty. But this I found to be very, very interesting. And this is the trio that came with it. And that's what it looks like. And I'll give you back here a little shot of it as well. I really, really like that pink. I think that is such a pretty pink and um, these are supposed to be, this is supposed to be the um, blush and according to the girl, this is a highlighter and then this is a bronzer. I just thought that was a weird color for a bronzer, but I don't know. I'm blinding you with this mirror. I'm so sorry, but I don't know if this would be a good bronzer or not, but I kind of thought it would be pretty as an eyeshadow, but she said you can use it as whatever you want. So I'm going to swatch them on my finger and that's what they look like. The pink or the, this is the highlighter and this one is supposed to be the bronzer. <laughs> and then, see, I can't do that very well. And then, ah, and then that's supposed to be the, um, that's supposed to be the blush, which of course that is the blush. And I really do like the colors a lot. Um, they're kind of, I don't know if I would wear them as, I, I don't know what I would wear them as, but I just thought I got it all for $29 and I just thought for that price, you really just can't beat it. So, you know, the blush alone is worth that or the mascara alone is worth that or the lip gloss alone is worth that. So definitely think I got a pretty good deal. Like I said, the whole kit was $29 at Sephora and it's one of those ones that are setting up by the register, like how they have all their little you know, good finds or whatever by the register. So definitely a good buy on that and real happy to give this a try. So I'll definitely let you know how it all turns out. And then um, what else? Oh, and um, when I was in Sephora the day that I bought the sweatshirt, I was in a different Sephora or a different JCPenney's hint Sephora. But I went in there to actually exchange or something. I don't remember what it was, but um, I saw this um, Elamasca nail polish and this is the color, 
what is it? Joy, what does that say? Jomina. It's the color Jomina. And it's a beautiful purple color. I just absolutely love this purple. And I thought it's going to be so pretty for Easter. 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 Okay. Doesn't want to come out of the container now. There we go. And this is what it looks like. That is such a beautiful purple. I love this purple. Gorgeous. I did have it on my fingers um, the last couple of days of this week. I wanted to see what it looked like. And it's very, very, very pretty. So I'm really excited about having that on. I think I'm going to put it on for Easter week, I think. Um, so I think that's going to be my nail of the week color. That's why I didn't really show it to anyone because I, I just kind of threw it on just to see what it looked like. So I think definitely it's going to be my color for Easter, I think, anyhow. And let's see. I think. Oh, well, let me show you this. I got this actually last week. And, um, well, you wouldn't even know that because you didn't see that haul video because I lost that haul video. But um, I had left this out in the haul video. And I have put all my stuff away before I realized that I was going to lose all my items on my laptop. But I did buy this at Walmart last week. And I thought this was really, really cute. I bought the swimsuit. And it is just a little skirt and it's a little top. It's a little two piece and um, that's what it looks like. And yes, it is a two piece. And yes, I'm an old lady wearing a two piece swimsuit, but I will have on a tank top over top of this. So I am actually going to go look for a mesh type of a tank top to wear over it. And um, so that way you can see through it, but you can't really see through it. You know what I'm saying? So I will hide my little rolls, but I like having the little skirt because I like, I don't like having all this exposed or let me turn that around. I have a hard time with having all of this exposed and a lot of the swimsuits do have a lot of exposure going on there. So um, I wanted to get something that had a little skirt on it. And um, I love the whole zebra look on this so this was just totally me and I could not resist it so I got this for like um I think it was a little bit pricey for Walmart I think the whole thing was like $35 but I just love it I think it's really pretty so I'm excited about wearing this this summer when I go to the pool and I think that is it I'm going to stand up very quickly and just kind of show you what I have on and I'm burning up um as far as I'm just lounging around the house today so nothing spectacular nothing exciting but I do love this little $4 sweatshirt that I have on. And I do hope to be able to find one of my chicken, one more JC JCPenney's uh, tomorrow and see if I can find it. But it's just a long sleeve, oversized. I got this in a large um, because I wanted it to be kind of blousy, but um, just comfortable to put on. This time of year, it's usually cold in stores, hot outside. Today, it's like 90 degrees outside, so it's super hot. So I am a little bit warm in the house with this on. And, um, but it's great to have on, you know, when you're going to be gone and you go inside of a store and it's cool because I can push the sleeves up when I'm outside and pull the sleeve down when I'm inside, if I, I get a little chilly. And then I just have on just a Forever 21 tank top underneath, nothing spectacular, just one of the little, you know, tank tops from Forever 21. And of course I have on my Victoria's Secret sweats or leggings that I truly, truly love. I, these are like my favorite. I do want to go back and get another pair of these because I do love them. And um, the earrings I have on are just some um, Western type earrings that I bought a long time ago from, I don't even remember where, but I love these earrings. I thought they looked kind of look cute with my hair the way it is tonight. And I don't even really have on very much jewelry, just my watch, wedding bands. I do have on my, um, Mother's heart ring from James Avery and my one ring that I always wear on my finger and of course my wedding rings. So that's basically what I have on. Let me show you my flip flops. Oh. I have on my Justin flip flops again today. These are super comfortable. I love these things. I wear them a lot in the summertime. So that is basically everything in my haul today. Thank you so much for sharing with me today. I hope you have a very blessed Saturday. God bless. Have a great weekend. Bye-bye.